Yo guys, what's going on? It's your boy Kyori and welcome back to uh, Generation Zero. Now, in this one, we have a lot to talk about. Not really, but still, we're still going to go ahead with it. <laughs> Yo, what a what a shitty video introduction. We're going to leave it in there anyway because I'm I'm a lazy editor. But in today's one, as you guys will notice, I have an absolute ton of these um, control point uh phoenix assault bases that we have to destroy i also have an absolute ton of um base assault missions as well what, what's there one one two three four so there's four base assaults so sorry no more i missed them one two three four five six sorry so there's six base assaults and there is one two three four five six seven eight nine ten and there's ten <laughs> base assault missions that is crazy yes yeah. so six base defense 10 base assault now i want to actually focus on some base assault missions today um and while we do that i can just ramble on with what i need to talk about and uh yeah we're all hunky dory now the problem is with these base assault missions i know we do these often but it's a good way to talk about how it's like probably the one of the best ways to get yourself experimental weapons if not five crowns as well and um and yeah, then I can just, you know, talk about my, uh, my, well, what I need to talk about, all that kind of crap. As you can see, it's already spawning in, um, enemies, which, <laughs> which sucks. I hate this. It's entrenched. And by the way, if you didn't know the difference between, um, entrenched and not entrenched, the entrenched ones have the, um, we'll zoom in as far as we can, have the little red. So it has like a barrier or like has the inner, what is, how many sides? hexagon six all right so it has the inner um hexagon that's uh that's red with the white and it has a black outline around it and then it has red little like arrows on every corner of the black so that's entrenched meaning like level three uh then you've got this one over here perfect example this one again it has the inner hexagon red with the white shield through it or the white resistance logo i'm pretty sure that's what it is and then it just has the black little arrows around it, no black barrier. So that's level one. And then this one over here, as you guys can see, again, inner hexagon, red, white. And then it has the black arrows, but it also has a black border, meaning it's level two. Yeah. All right. Perfect. Now, I just want to quickly apologize if this video looks a little bit compressed or anything like that, maybe squished together for you guys. I am trying my best. I did just get a new ultra wide monitor. So I am trying to work out the difficulties of, well, recording in 3440 by 40, sorry, 1440p and then having YouTube com uh, compress that shit down. Now, from my tests so far, it's worked quite well, like way better than I expected. Um, and in which there's only uh, maybe like a centimeter black bar on the top and bottom, which is, oh Christ, I didn't even see that come which is honestly like the best outcome I've had so far. What the hell? I did not see, oh, those ones over there. I was gonna say, I'm like, I'm not seeing these guys. All right, so these, so this one is looking like it only spawns in um, runners, which I am fine with. So we'll have a little fun with the uh, artillery rifle. Get these walls down. And then we can go in and do our do what we need to do. You know, actually, that's gonna take way too long. Oh, well, relax, buddy. Relax. You too. Oh, yo, I just opened it all up. Let's go. All right, is there any turrets I need to take care of real quick? You're a turret. Wait, who beeped at me? Ow, stop being mean. Alright, so I need to open you. Oh crap. No, you little bastards! Alright, that's my fault. I got I got way too uh got way too cocky with that. But that is fine, nevertheless. Whoa, where's that other tower coming from? No, not the mines! Run! 
All right, that was a terrible way to start this um this base assault mission. There's so many of these, but like people, where are they all coming from? Whoa. All right. All right. So a lot of people were asking in the comments, like a great way to level up this right here. Great way to uh, level up the, as long as you stay within the base assault, like zone, it'll keep pumping out more machines for you to kill. Ugh. Now, luckily for me, oh my God. Luckily for me, they're only hunters. Sorry, they're only runners, so it's quite easy to uh, actually take care of them. But yeah, so you could legitimately just spawn here, wait a couple minutes, more will come in, take them down. Now, you're not going to get much from runners. They are quite easy to take down. They don't offer much XP. Now, a quick little thing as well. Like, I understand grinding up until like level 30. But once you get past level, I'm pretty sure I'm not, look, I'm not, don't quote me on it. I have to do more research, but I'm pretty sure once you get to level 32 now, you don't get any more, um, levels. Like it, it was pretty vague. The information I had because, um, because as of the new, like as of the, one of the previous updates, I wasn't around for one of these updates. It said that, um, the level cap had increased to 10,000 and I'm thinking to myself, well, that, that's cool. Well, one, that's you know, not even achievable. So no one's going to be able to get to that point. And that's fair enough. But then I was also like, well, that's kind of awesome because now we can get all of the, um, we can get all of the skills we want. Like we can still only have one specialty skill unlocked like down the bottom. But other than that, we could legitimately get all of them. But it turns out, no, once you, uh, you start, you stop actually unlocking the skills at like around like 32 which is uh, a bit piss poor because why would you put the level cap to 10,000 if like this? Yeah, I don't know. It is what it is, right? All right, just heal up. As you can see, like see more and more spawning and you can see him dropping down from the sky. Oh, I haven't got to that one yet, have I? Oh, no. All right, there we go, sorted. Yay! Ow! What the? F oh my God, those chain reactions in this game, man, I swear. Yeah, so um, definitely if you're coming for XP, definitely just keep doing these, especially find yourself an entrenched one because usually the entrenched ones will um, have a variety of hunters and um, Runners. This one's just hunters. I'm sorry, just runners. It's a pain in the ass, to be honest. I think I'd rather hunters. Can you stop fucking shooting me, please? And even... The f oh, it's behind here. You know, this is where we're going to make our stand, lads. Oh, I toasted those guys. Yeah, guys, so it's um, it's really important to me that you, um, if you do watch the majority of this video, I'm not trying to persuade you to watch all of it, but like if you do watch majority of it, please let me know um, how the how the graphics are, if it's not too stretched or anything like that. Like, don't get me wrong, um, if you have it on theater mode in 2560 uh, by 1440, if that's what your monitor native resolution is, it honestly doesn't look too bad. It's actually quite nice. Now, most of you guys know that YouTube won't even support 3440 by 1440. So naturally it does uh, stretch it down a little bit, but it should also automatically stretch to the resolution, sorry, like fit the resolution of your screen. Unless it's an ultra wide, really. But there are applications for you to uh, view YouTube and Netflix and all those things in, um, in an ultra wide format. It does just heavily condense them. All right, so where are we, where are we going? the frick is the thing bubble? All right, I'm going to definitely send two in there. Fuck. 
Those direct hits with those rockets are gnarly. I don't think I've ever been directly hit with a uh, one of those mini rockets from one of these guys. Where's the command center? I still can't bloody see it. Now guys, don't worry about the um, about me losing all this health. I do have like 150 or something like that. Um, advanced med kits in my plunger. So I'm not um, too worried. No, if it's over, is it over there? It's over there, so I'm gonna see if I can... See if that works. Ah, uh, it might just be to the to the left too much. Oh no. Ah, dead on, let's go. No. I still can't get over this this guy because it just it just barely it just barely even kills these like it only kills them if you if you shoot their freaking gas canister if not it's like a two or three shot see there you go <laughs> Christ. no do not shoot bad bad i'm wasting so much health and time guys i'm so sorry I'm gonna, I'll just keep going. I need to get rid of you guys. You okay. Does he still have his shield up? He does not. Oh, actually, I might have grenades for this. Oh, actually, no, nah, I can just use mine to the re rifle. Yo, this weapon grew on me heaps. I actually really like it now. Like, don't get me wrong, I think I think it might need a bit of a damage buff because I spent like 50, maybe 60 rounds of ammunition, like direct hits on a tank just to destroy it, which seemed a little bit far-fetched to me, but... Once you get the angle right, and the distance, fuck, it's it's actually really fun to use. Hey, look, a tank. I mean, I'm, fuck, I can't even. I, I even I even play this game. I don't even know what kind of bloody machine I'm going up against. I meant I meant a hunter. Pretty cool. Ah. By the way, guys, this is not like a good example of um. How to how to do one of these base assault missions so please please don't be like oh my god you suck like i'm just i'm just trying to have some fun i have done like a million of these before and they get rather boring sometimes so um no i need to enjoy myself playing this game too oh jesus he made me miss my shot wait what it's it's not even taking any hits how is that possible ah you little shivers that's it I'm still standing. Okay, that wasn't a bad. That wasn't. That wasn't a good idea. I thought I'd make like a, a nice little one, one, like last stand there, but it, it it didn't it didn't work out quite like that. Um, by the way, guys, the amount of like support and comments now i'm getting on the um, on these videos are absolutely nuts so um you know I'm, I'm, I'm taking that to mean you're enjoying the videos and if you are i honestly I, I, that, that's crazy honestly it's um yeah it's so cool yeah the amount of feedback i'm getting people asking for help you know what i mean so like thank you for uh well trusting that or believing that i know what the hell i'm doing this is definitely not a good example showing that i know what i'm doing but um but yeah, so if you do have any, um, oh yeah, by the way, don't destroy these little things in here. They're the spawners, if you guys didn't actually know. Um, but yeah, so yeah, again, thank you for the, uh, the overall mix support. Um, 
just on this playthrough in general, actually, like, I know Generation Zero always performed well on the channel, but, like, damn. Like, this is pretty crazy. No, 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 bad daddy, bad daddy. Yes, I just did call a hunter my daddy. It's okay. You took that like a champ. I shot you in the butt. All right. Yo, the last one is getting a Hail Mary from the uh, the artillery rifle. I'm just saying. All right. So they stopped. So. Uh, uh, uh. See if that helps. Oh, you ready? Oh, look at this. Oh, the first one's direct hit, surely. Oh, damn it. It missed. Are we looking? Nah, that's that's not close enough. I don't believe. Don't knife me again, please. I'm trying to, I'm trying to do some trick shots for the boys and girls. Sorry. The problem is it's way too far away for these guys actually to get destroyed. So um, I, I kind of just, um, yeah, shot myself in the foot there because now I've got to deal with all these guys. Which, with the KVM-59 machine gun, is not a problem. I'm actually looking forward to getting the, uh, the experiment. Oh, you jump way too far. I'm actually looking forward to getting the experimental um, rounds, the KVM. 762 rounds are going to be fun as stop running they know that it's like if they get close to me that I can't use this gun because I just end up lightening myself oh where did you come from buddy oh ouchies I've already used way too much health and um thingy kits Adrenaline shots. By the way, I seem to get on a tangent. I seem to keep... Where the fudge is he? Does anyone else see him? Wow. Oh, they're all the way back here. I thought these guys, they look dead on my screen. But yeah, so I seem to keep getting off on a tangent. I was talking about... Um, I don't even know actually what I was talking about. Yeah, levels, that's it. So like, if we look over here, again, sorry about the UI. Like the UI, it's not really native. Uh, 30, 34, 40 by 1440. It doesn't stretch quite as far so that's why that you've got the great barriers in the side just in case you're seeing that now um if we come into the skills yeah so i'm thinking to myself damn like you know ten thousand levels that's awesome you know we, we'll be able to get all of these um what is there like five ten so like 40 40 old little like character thing like skills if we can go on every tech tree i'm like sick and then we can only activate one of the specialties down the bottom i'm like that's fine you know i can go I can go marksman because you know I I need the uh, I like using the PVG I like having no um no weapon sway kind of thing, but um but yeah so I stopped putting my I stopped really focusing on what like I really wanted because it didn't really matter I could just put anything on anything if that makes sense like and get it so yeah but no it doesn't it doesn't work like that guys so um. <laughs> That's why I'm glad I have so much uranium. I can really like actually mess around here and hone what I need. Right now, for the start of the game, I like, look, don't get me wrong. Like I'm probably going to ramble on for the rest of the video, but having uranium and the reset skill points button is such an amazing feature. It never used to be here. And I'm really glad that they've, uh, they've done the reset skills because right now, a lot of these, I would only need right at the start of the game. Like lock picking. I don't really need lock picking anymore. Um, and there's nothing I really need to lockpick other than like when I needed ammo and you, uh, like other parts that you go into those uh, kind of like armory things with the four doors and you can unlock, you can pick one side, well you can pick all four sides, but you only want to do one obviously. So lockpicking I don't really need. Um, salvage I don't really need anymore because I can just, I've got that, that much, like that, yeah, like I've got so much um, materials, like I don't actually need these to find weapons anymore sorry to find ammo anymore i can just create it myself um now 
mechanical yeah this it's not too bad i mean like having mechanical too i mean sometimes if you if you want if you want ammo you just go around destroying firebirds half the time i mean it, it gave me a thousand and thirteen uh 762 fmj rounds the other day like it was nuts so mechanics always good but again you have to you know you have to waste like uh four four bloody points right there like there's still a few um a few of these I, look i always go for the exact same tech tree every time it's always combat and it's always like half and half of tech and survival and i never go in support i just don't believe the, the support one like i'm not being rude but who the fuck sorry i can't swear youtube sorry sorry who the hell uses binoculars? Who marks their enemies? Maybe at the start of the game because you're creeping around everywhere, but right now you just run and gun absolutely everything. I mean, I don't know if that's your playstyle, but bro, if you're not running and gunning, you're missing out. Flanking, so 20% to and 40% uh, chance of stagger. Um, so increase the chance of causing stagger when firing at an enemy that is targeting another player. Well, that's all good and well, but I don't know about you, but I don't play with anyone else. I play by myself, so that's that's pointless. Otherwise, that 40% uh, chance to stagger would be epic. And now I know you could obviously argue that if it was fighting a Russian or vice versa, that you could do it, but then, like, that's, that's not, you know, there's like three areas where the Russians aren't, so that's pointless. I don't know. Look, I'm not going to waste any more time. Um, I'm going to call the episode here. Just let me know down below in the comments section if you do want me to go through like a deep dive into the skill tree or I can just do it in one of the uh, one of the episodes. It's up to you guys if you're uh, if you're up to that. Now, I know a lot of people do comment what they're struggling with um, or what they're thinking is hard and where they can find this and that. Now, please keep doing that. That is awesome. It's great for one, video ideas, and two, if I can just like quickly like message you back on the YouTube comments thing. Um, I'll do that straight away just in case I help. Like I just recently told um, helped a guy out with um, getting his first experimental PBG. That was awesome. Bro, shout out to you, man. That's crazy. You basically uh, basically clocked the game now. PBG is everything in this game. But um, yeah, guys, so moral of the story, if you have any video ideas, whatever you're struggling with, just let me down, uh, let me know down below and I'll always um, I'll always get back to you. But uh, yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching. And again, thank you so much for the overwhelming support and the, uh, well, on this playthrough so far, there's still so much for us to do. I'm milking the hell out of these videos now because I, I just, one, I'm enjoying them and two, like you guys seem to as well. So like, why not, right? But uh, yeah, and again, um, if you are enjoying, like, comment, subscribe. But remember, this is the first video I'll be posting on the new ultra wide setup, like recording from my ultra wide. So be sure to let me know how the video quality is because, um, YouTube seemed to dull the quality of the videos in this resolution. So I'm hoping that's not the case. I think I worked it out, but it might be a bit of a, a uh, bit of a test. The next couple, uh, next couple of videos just to see um, like what, which recording settings work and whatnot. But uh, yeah, guys, um, I'll let you guys go. I'll see you guys in the next one. Take it easy. Peace.